Oh hi! I shot this video for the second time because I wasn't happy with the first video that I shot. So double like for that. <laughs> hi guys, welcome back to my channel. It's finally winter and it's the Christmas month. I am so excited. In today's video, I'll be talking about winter essentials, which means we'll talk about skincare and the sweatshirts and outfits that you can slay this winter season. So yeah, let's start with the video. I believe that this season the whole tie and dye thing is back and it makes me super happy because I remember in class 12 in our fashion designing class oh by the way all my FD girls comment hi and heart and uh, so yeah uh, during my FD practicals we were taught how to do the whole tie and dye thing and it was such a nice experience to learn something which is super interesting I remember we dyed like a whole dupatta a few handkerchiefs and all of that so yeah the thing is the whole tie and dye thing is back in trend and I have this cute sweatshirt right here this one I think I bought some two to three years back right after my ISC ended which is in 2018 and it's super comfortable super cozy as you can see the whole Prussian blue and white goes so aesthetic and it's very much aesthetically pleasing it's a cropped one by the way and the sleeves are pretty long and whenever I travel I always prefer wearing this because this is super super cozy and I love this I mean I love everything I own most of the things that I own because I buy it only when I like it so yeah <laughs> to show because that's the only thing I bought for winter this season and I have kept all the sweatshirts in like in a row so ta-da it's this one I love this this is from Urbanic and the color oh my god I love the color it comes with a full sleeve and some buttons in front and the emphasis of everything is this cute little daisy now this is not stitched it comes with a safety pin you can remove it if you want to but I just love the whole vibe it gives you know it's amazing and you can like wear it in different ways and it's just super super trending right now so yeah <laughs> trend and trending sweatshirt this season I feel it's the turtleneck now it's something when we used to be small in our childhood days our mom would like force us to wear but we would like no we hate those but now we just want one of those in different colors so I have one which is a very staple color it's white in color and tara this is the one that I have and it's a very shiny material and it's not full sleeves by the way unlike any other turtlenecks but I love how it is and you know the best part is you can layer your turtlenecks and this is the layering season guys so keep layering and yeah it, you will just kill the look if you start layering your turtlenecks with blazers or any other cami top it will be so amazing and so cool I have some few clips short clips which I have filmed for you guys to see how I have styled those like in a very minimal way so let's roll that clip
going with some vibrant color so I have this one right here I love this I mean this is a whole two color sweatshirt and that is also super trending right now even Kendall and Kylie Jenner's collection collaboration with Forever 21 even they have few uh, two colored sweatshirts as well now this one is also from Forever 21 and this is a high neck one it comes with a zip I love the whole mustard and beige color going on on this sweatshirt and it's also cropped by the way and there's elastic in the end of the sweatshirt and it just stands out and it's very comfortable all the sweatshirts are comfortable because comfort is the first step whenever you're wearing an outfit you need to be comfortable in that right so yeah this is something i got last year because this time i only got one thing which is uh, the one i showed you before but yeah like this is amazing and this has like a balloon sleeve not like exactly a balloon sleeve but this is like quite baggy when i wear it and i love it <laughs> one is a pullover and this is something like a must have in your winter wardrobe and I have this one this is a whole uh, how many times am I saying whole no this is a nude pullover which has some detailing of a bow in its back and this was gifted to me by my mama who lives in Texas so this is uh, from US but you will find amazing pullovers on Mintra, Ajiro, Urbanic and many such shopping stores so yeah and uh, this is quite long and very oversized and baggy I do not always wear this I do, or I do not prefer wearing, wearing this so much because I personally do not like like oversized clothes so but I do wear this sometimes because this is super aesthetic when you're wearing it it gives you like some Pinteresty vibe okay so I do wear it sometimes but not every time but again a pullover is like a must have and it depends on you whether you want like an oversized one or something that fits you hugs your body perfectly so go for the one which you prefer so yeah with all the outfit parts let's move on to one of the most important part during winter which is taking care of your skin skincare part right so i have like what one two three four four products which you need during winter for your skin to not cry because trust me it doesn't matter whether you're a boy or a girl when it comes to your skin it's very very essential to take care of your skin especially during the season of winter because your skin tends to be super super dry again it doesn't really matter whether your skin you're like a combination skin type or an oily skin type you have to take care of your skin so i'll just quickly tell you the products that i use and the products that you should also incorporate in your daily routine so that it helps your skin to hydrate and nourish 
so starting off with a face oil now this is my first time using a face oil I have recently got this plum goodness face oil and this let me tell you works like magic on my skin my skin has been feeling so so good ever since I started using it and this is a very lightweight serum and it has a lot of things actually grape seed and sea buckthorn glow restore face oils blend now this has vitamin e vitamin c and many such essential oils that your skin really need so you can go for first of all you need to know your skin type right you can't just blindly go and buy a face oil so first know your skin type and then go for a particular face oil that you feel suits your you know skin type Next up, after you are done with like applying a face oil, what you can do is to help your skin nourish a lot more, apply a lightweight moisturizer. Now, I use the Nivea Soft Vitamin E Light Moisturizer. I always prefer this one. I think whenever it comes to skincare, I am skincare in the sense during winter season, I always, always prefer Nivea over any other brand. I don't think I've really tried so many brands because Nivea is something I really trust. So I use this Nivea Light Moisturizer. This is the pocket size one. It comes in various sizes. And let me tell you, this works again like magic and it's amazing. It's very much lightweight as its name suggests. And it won't make you feel that you know you have applied something. No, this is very, very good for your skin to hydrate. It, because your skin actually needs a lot of hydration during this season. Next is something we all use, I don't think I have to tell, but since I am talking about essentials, so it's a body lotion. This is the Nivea Oil and Lotion Cocoa Nourish Deep Moisture Care. Now this, the texture of this is great, trust me it is. If you are thinking which body lotion to purchase, I would suggest go for this. The smell of cocoa butter is heavenly, I love the smell. I think I love anything which has, you know, a little bit a sense of vanilla, or something sort of that so I love this as well the texture the feel it gives on your skin it's amazing next up I think we all use this no matter what and these are the lip balms these are the two that I primarily use this is the Too Faced peach lip balm this has a nice smell it both of them do not have any tint because I personally do not prefer any tinted lip balm now this is the Too Faced one and it's good before you know you apply lipstick or something you can apply this and then the lipstick and the other one is the NMFE lip care now I think this is a medicated one because this has been prescribed by my dermatologist and again if your lips are in a very very bad condition you can definitely try this out guys otherwise we all have borolin at least right apply that before you go to sleep it helps your lips at least otherwise go for this or any other lip balms uh, there are like amazing lip balms out there as well in the market you have himalayan and other lip balms and coming to maybelline lip balms i'm not a big fan of those because even though I used it, I won't lie that I haven't, I definitely did. And I remember it was a thing in middle school, okay, when I was in class 7, 8. Uh, when it has recently launched and everyone used to carry one of those, every girl, uh, one of those in their blazer pockets. And I am from convent school. Till class 10, I was in a convent school. So our teachers would randomly come and start searching our blazer pockets to see whether we are carrying any beauty product or not. And that was scary. But um, yeah, I think most of us, most of the girls at least, you know, used to carry those and hit in their uh, bags or in their pencil bags, something like that. So basically a story thing, <laughs> a story time. But anyway... Uh, so that is basically all the products, all the winter essentials, be it skincare or clothes or uh, sweatshirts that I had to show you guys. I don't think there's anything on my head right now. My camera's battery is dying. It dies every other second. Oh. Anyway, in case you liked watching my video, then do not forget to give it a big thumbs up, share with your friends and subscribe to my channel. And what else? Yeah, if you are not already following me on Instagram, I'll leave my handle on the screen. Go and follow me there. And by the way, did you notice my hoodie? 
this is my high school hoodie and my school anyway i think hoodie is something we all have in our wardrobe so i didn't talk about hoodies and denim jackets or polyester jackets or any such jackets so yeah that is basically all i'll see you guys next time bye